at a very young age, but wasn't sure that I could make a living cooking. So, but then when I was given the opportunity to come work here, it worked out. So. Jeremy seems to think it's going swimmingly. Swimming. <laughs> That's an old school. Old school thing, way of talking. That's a new school bringing that back. I'm going to help you bring it back. Back in the time. <laughs> no, baby, no, baby, no, baby. Woo. You remember that? Yeah. <laughs> Have you seen the... Go ahead, never mind. We'll talk about it later. What's up? I'll, I'll talk. I'll ask. I'll tell you. Are we on? Yeah, we're on. I enjoy cooking. I've been cooking since I was about eight or nine years old. Um, I was raised by my mother mostly and uh, lived with grandparents. Our cooking in those homes was American, uh, Southern, old fashioned biscuits and gravy, and pig. And my father um, grew up. In California with Mexicanos, and so a lot of that influence comes into my cooking. My wife is from Baltimore and lived in Florida and parts of the South, um, so a lot of that influence is in what I do. But I like food, period. I grew up pretty much in the Bay Area, San Francisco Bay Area. I've been exposed to a lot of different things and enjoy all of it. You might even use that part of the intro. We got about two minutes before. He's gonna run around and grab a couple of things. I let them all know to come back. So. All right. Well, you're in the movie. I don't know what. You're in the movie. Apparently. Everybody is. Well, Crystal says she can't come because she can't control her car. She can't control her car. So I'm here to take some to them. Okay. Party's not coming. Uh, I don't think so. I can go. I can come and then have her come. So okay. I'll come and then go. And so he's going to be able to edit it out. Anyway, so. Totally won't. So you're going to taste it on camera. Oh. And the soup is ready. Coming back. I'm going to burn my tongue. Blue off. Is that a blue? I don't know how to flip. Because for whatever reason, I suspect that 
Perhaps they've had bad ministry. They yeah. haven't had good soup. And I think that the same thing applies with cameras. Yeah. If you have a bad experience with anything, right? You have a tendency not to enjoy it from that point further. Exactly. Until somebody happens to open up your eyes and give you a taste of something that's right, mm -hmm. or give you the experience that's right. You know, if you get on a motorcycle the first time you do fall down and wreck, you're like, oh, no, thanks. Oh. I'm like, I'm good. I don't know how to ride. Yeah, not everybody try likes to get else. back. <laughs> not everybody wants to get back on the horse. Yeah. yeah. And then sometimes you just you do try it multiple times, multiple different perspectives. You're just, it's just not your thing. So, well, we have no problem with that. All right, I'll have Artie come. Okay. Oh, let me take Tristan, because she's not coming in. I love it. I love it. I, love it. I want to be able to send a copy of this. Oh, okay. For my sister. The one I actually made it for. Once we get it all ready to do it. What? Like what? No, oh, you want this one? It's <laughs> green in there. You want all that green, Ray? Oh, I'm all that green. How are you doing? I'm all right. How are you? Good. Nice to see you. Nice to see you, too. Oh. Hot, 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 hot. What do they have minestrone that's usually not vegan? Oh, uh, roast beef. Oh, quite often. But we used a vegetable base and, and roasted garlic base to make the soup stock itself. And then uh, it's got the pasta, it's got the beans. There's, there's a lot of protein in it because it has chickpeas and uh, kidney beans. Um, you can add cannelli beans, you can add black beans. I don't, you know, it's, the combinations are endless. I you enjoy it. Be really good with some hamburgers. <laughs> <laughs> this ham? one? Hamburger. <laughs> this is my or ham. Yeah, I talked about that in, in, in the show that you can use roast beef or hamburger, even bacon. Kevin Bacon? Huh? Kevin? Not Kevin. <laughs> I'm a fan, but I'm not that big. I'll take Kevin. I'll take Kevin. <laughs> I was talking how I love how it flows together. Uh-huh. Yum. I have to like my own cooking. It warms my heart. <laughs> I'm so glad that I'm part of this experience. Well, good. So what does it remind you of? We also have um, a sandwich corn chowder. It reminds me of my first one. He's going to start doing videos of me. Child? Yeah, this is the first born child. Awesome. My first born child. I would take him to a restaurant and all he ever ate was going to stroke soup. And I would just dump it on the tray. And he would eat all the stuff. Yeah. 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 So this is a kid's meal as well. Oh, you know, minestrone is for anybody if it's done right. She said, grandson or? No, my boy. My oldest boy. Oh, yeah. Tomatoes. Tomatoes. Is this the soup of the day? No, I've got Southwest corn chowder is what's on the oh. menu board that I wanted to cook this. Yeah. <laughs> they don't want to be on the camera.
you. I get paid for being on camera, you know. Mm -hmm. You know. You get paid for being on camera. Yeah, I should. Huh? You should. I should. Six three, six four, yeah, six three. You look tall, but you kind of look like you're not tall because you're so skinny. <laughs> it's weird. Because <laughs> usually people who are super tall, they're like really wide. It makes no, it look even no, 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 yeah. no, it's you get big and, and thin people in all heights. Yeah, I'm, I'm not saying I'm not saying it's bad. I'm just saying it's different. Yeah, you're good. She's fixed that. No, she's <laughs> 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 How many times have you been told that? Fix yourself. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. How about a smile on it, Grow up with it, or um, just on a mission? I took two years in high school, and then I came out here. I was speaking English. I asked uh, the mission president to make me Spanish, so I got sent to South Lake Tahoe to speak in Spanish there. I got like two three months in Spanish, but I, uh, almost all of my employees are, are Hispanic. Really? And I grew up with it. It's, I'm not necessarily incredibly fluent, but I've been told that I don't have a gringo accent when I speak Spanish. It's, it's funny because my companion in South Tahoe. He knew a lot more than me, but he had a pretty good accent. Whereas I could like roll my R's and, and your team was teaching this guy. He said it's funny because you don't know much Spanish, but your accent is like. I'm laughing about that. So, hi, I'm she he Chef Huck King. Let's try that. Hi. <laughs> wait, 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 wait. You gotta wait, wait. breathe real quick. <laughs> okay. Ready? Get out of my way. <laughs> hi. I'm Chef Huck King, and it really is that easy. You want to do that again? 